India's brave heart, who became the focus of women around India and their fight against gender-based violence, was honored by the United States with posthumous Woman of Courage Award. U.S. First Lady Michelle Obama joined Secretary of State John Kerry as he presented the award which recognizes women around the globe who have shown exceptional courage in advocating women's rights, often at great personal risk. The 23-year-old medical student's brutal gang rape on a moving bus on the 16th of December in the capital inspired widespread protests. She was shifted to a Singapore hospital for treatment where she succumbed tragically to her injuries on the 29th of December. The State Department press release called Delhi's Braveheart the foundation of a popular movement to end violence against women in India. The victim's ordeal led to demonstrations by thousands of people demanding justice and better treatment for women's safety and put pressure on police and the government to improve the judicial system. Nirbhaya's fight survives her. For inspiring people to work together to end violence against women in India and around the world, by displaying immense courage in demanding justice, as this inscription reads, and with great sadness, we honor Nibaye, a woman of exceptional courage, and we honor her posthumously. So please stand and join me, if you would, in a moment of silence for Nibaye. <laughs> 